range of keratometer. With manual keratometer, 36 diopter to 52 diopter can be measured. If corneal power in any meridian is less than 36 diopter or more than 52 diopter, then we have to add an extra lens to measure corneal power. This procedure is called extended keratometer. Remember, these extra lens are placed before the eye pitch, not in front of the patient's eye. Now, for higher than 52 diopter, a plus 1.25 diopter that is equal to 9 diopter lens is placed over the eyepiece which allows us to measure up to 52 plus 9 diopter equal to 61 diopter. But the reading that we will get in keratometer after placing plus 1.25 diopter in front of the eyepiece won't be the corneal dioptic power. We need to modify this reading to get exact corneal power. The formula is K reading after placing plus 1.25 multiplied by 1.185. For example, if with a plus 1.25 diopter lens, K reading is 48 diopter, then the final power will be 48 multiplied by 1.185, that is 56.88 diopter. So after placing plus 1.25 diopter lens, our K reading was 48 diopter, but the actual keratometer reading is 56.88 diopter. For less than 36 diopter, a minus 1 diopter lens which is equal to 6 diopter is placed over the eye pitch which allows us to measure up to 36 minus 6 equal to 30 diopter. And the final K reading will be K reading after placing minus 1 diopter multiplied by 0.840. For example, if with minus 1 diopter K reading is 36 diopter, then the final power will be 36 multiplied by 0.84 equal to 30.24 diopter. Stay with smart optometry and study optometry smartly.